Welcome back to Good Morning Arkansas, everyone. Now, each May, the National Osteoporosis Foundation, or NOF, works to generate awareness and inspire behavioral change regarding the critical importance of good bone health and osteoporosis intervention. Here to talk more on this is Dr. Stephen Paulus with Ortho Arkansas. Dr. Paulus, thank you so much for joining us. How do you know if you have osteoporosis? So most people don't know that they have osteoporosis. It's really a silent disease, and often it's unrecognized until somebody has a fracture, until somebody breaks a bone. Yeah, that is not something I'm very familiar with, so I could imagine a lot of people wouldn't know until something is happening. Who can get osteoporosis? Who is in the way of possibly experiencing this? You know, really anybody can get it at almost any age, but certainly women over the age of 50, postmenopause, people that have certain medical conditions that require them to take medications frequently, like uh, corticosteroids. Um, people that smoke, people that don't get enough exercise, or that don't have good dietary habits are at risk. Okay, gotcha. Now, that kind of covers the, the whole spectrum of people who could get it. Let's talk about the people who are at the greatest risk. Could you tell me a little bit more about um, what, by, what might enhance the risk for generating osteoporosis? <clears throat> certainly. So if you've had a broken bone over the age of 50 already, you're certainly at increased risk for osteoporosis. Um, women who have had their ovaries surgically removed before menopause or after, uh, or if they're already after menopause, um, if you haven't gotten enough calcium or vitamin D particularly in your diet, if you're physically inactive, or if you've had bed rest previously, if you smoke, um, if you take certain medications, like I mentioned, glucocorticoids in particular, um, body frame, uh, people that are petite and uh, just smaller frames are at increased risk for osteoporosis as well. Oh, wow. Okay. So we've learned then, Dr. Paulus, that this is kind of a, a silent thing that can happen to people, can creep up on people. So how is osteoporosis diagnosed then? So in the absence of a fracture, when you reach 65, your doctor may recommend that you get something called a DEXA scan. Uh, which is a type of x-ray where they're actually measuring for the density of calcium within a certain little area of bone. And that can determine what your risk is for having a fracture due to osteoporosis. Okay, interesting. Is this preventable? Our viewers might want to know, especially our older viewers, is this preventable? And if it is something that is, you know, if someone gets it, how is it treated? How can people work through this? Absolutely. So lifestyle plays a big role in prevention. Um, getting enough calcium every day, uh, things like uh, dairy products, dark leafy green vegetables, making sure you have vitamin D, uh, which you can get from milk, lots of fish like salmon, tuna, um, wet, regular weight-bearing exercise. Cardiovascular exercise is great, but when you're using weight resistance, uh, that strengthens the muscles as well as the bones. Um, don't smoke, avoid excessive alcohol. Uh, so a lot of that is uh, lifestyle. Um, there's also some medical things that you uh, wanna watch out for in terms of like low hormone levels. If you're concerned about, you can talk to your doctor, uh, but most, mostly this is preventable, uh, especially the, if you start these habits at a younger age. Yeah, and I know many of us here growing up, of course, drink your milk, you got to have strong bones. So this is something that is drilled into our brains from a very young age, but definitely important to keep in mind, especially as we get older. So Dr. Paulus, if our viewers at home want to learn more about ortho Arkansas or maybe osteoporosis, what risks they could have, where could they reach you all at? So yeah, at ortho Arkansas, we love bone and we have a vested interest in preventing fractures as well as treating them when they happen. So our number is 501 area code 500-3500. Give us a call, any concerns. If you want to schedule with one of our bone health experts, we can get you evaluated and take care of you. Fabulous. Dr. Stephen Pauls, thank you so much for coming on and sharing your knowledge on osteoporosis, what our viewers at home may need to know. And viewers, stick with us. We will have more Good Morning Arkansas after this break.